Okay, guys, this will be short and sweet. So we just did that little section in the in the gizmo. Now all we're going to do is get that into our notebook so that it's there for that final exam and everything is right in the world. So first law, done. Second law, you now know it. It is called, instead of just second law, they'll also call it the law of equal areas. Whoops. E-A-S. So A-R-E-A-S. Sorry about that. The law of equal areas. And we're going to put it and write it almost word for word from that gizmo. It says that as a planet orbits, it sweeps out equal areas and equal time intervals. Okay, so as a planet orbits, it sweeps out equal areas and equal time intervals. That's because it's elliptical. If it was a perfect circle, it would every slice would look the same. Okay, every slice is still the same size in this pizza we've been talking about, but they all aren't gonna look the same. Okay, and so our reason, if we get this ellipse here, we had we'll try to draw it like this. Come on, pen. So our sun was here in this case. There was our imaginary foci, or focus, I should say, for singular. So we knew that when the Earth was here versus here. Remember, this one is going to be long and skinny. Okay, so this one maybe is going to be short and short and fat, where all the way through is going to be long and skinny. So if I tried to draw that piece of pizza from here, I know that's a horrible piece of pizza. Nobody would want that piece of pizza. Okay, but this one is what it would look like, because remember over here. It's slow, and that was why we spent so much time making sure we understand the first law. So it's slow when it's a long ways away. But here, your piece of pizza, I think this is the one I would choose, is going to be short and fat. Okay, so this is because the Earth, or the planet, I always say Earth, very self-centered here, but the planet is moving the fastest here. That does not look like that would be the same amount of pizza. This is my lack of drawing abilities, which I'm sure you are thrilled you still get to be a part of. Okay, so because of the change here, so as a planet orbits, it sweeps, sweeps out equal areas. So over here, this is where we would have the increased radius, which would be decreased speed of the planet. And over here, smaller radius, increased speed of the planet. All right, so that is our law of equal areas, and you saw it before we wrote it. Uh, next up is going to be the Cosmos video. There's yet another video of me yapping at you first, and talk about it with Miss Klein, and I hope you enjoy and pay attention to that video. It's a good one. Wish I was there to watch it with you. See ya.